all righty it's four o'clock somewhere and right now four o'clock is here which means we are getting back into the long dark i took a small break from the long dark for a stream and uh, i played Baldur's gate and that was something personally wasn't a fan but you know maybe i was playing it wrong Hello, Cause. Yes, you are first. Hello, Oliver. Thank you for keeping me alive. Good to see you guys. Good to see you guys. Mm. Too hydrated. Sorry, I'll take a big drink. Mm. Off to a good start with the hydrates. Uh, no, just two. Just two hydrates are redeemed. Okay, so it's been like only a few days since I've played, but last I remember we got mauled by the bear. We are now in the cave. I think it's chapter three of episode two. Should I drain you with 2k points? I don't think I have enough water. I have two bottles of water and one of them's got like a quarter taken out of it now. So I say you hold off. For a minute. Maybe you can save up and have me uh, raid your channel. As if I wouldn't do that already. Alright, what do I have? I've got some fucked up clothes. And that's it. So, right now, the goal, at least for the stream, not for right now, for the stretch cause, oh, get that handled while I kind of talk about this. So, the goal for this stream is to finish uh, episode two. I know we're like probably close to it, so if the, the end of episode two is a lot closer than I think, we might see how big of a chunk we can take out of episode three, uh, and then we'll have. Probably the same system go for finishing episode 3 and then getting into episode 4 and maybe just finishing that all uh, in one go. We'll see. Alright, legs are stretched out. Hopefully I don't cramp up too bad. How the fuck am I going to do this? I'm getting near episode 3. Alright, so I'll probably... What am I supposed to do? Oh. This is what I'm supposed to do. <sighs> Beware, bears no karate. I'll, uh, I'll keep that in mind, bud. <laughs> Not even that close. Don't be a little bitch. Where is that opening? Oh, I walked right past it. But yeah, episode two has been going for a little bit. So hopefully we can at least get that finished today. And I'm sure we will. But you can never be too sure. Ooh, don't want to fall down there. Oh wait, it's... Oh, the bear is out here. Okay, so this is like a stealth segment. That's actually really cool. Dead body over there.
Okay, dropping from there is kind of like a point of no return. Hmm. So where might we find our spear? Oh, shit. Start heading back this way for a second. Uh, I know there was... Yeah, here we go. Yeah, there's this tunnel right here. I don't know if that goes anywhere. So I think what we'll do is we'll kind of drop down to the side. Maybe. I see an opening that way. So that might be the move. Stay down on the ground for five seconds there before the bear can't eat you due to the five second rule. <laughs> you know what? In a bind, I'll consider it. Uh, it appears I've been made, but you can't do anything because I'm up here, bitch ass. So you stay down there and you mope and you bitch. Because I am... I, I am have high ground. Bears can fly. Uh, do do forgive me if I don't take your word for that. Oh fuck. Uh oh. Hey. Hey. Oh shit. No. I'm not on an even playing field. You know, let me try something really quick. Me, I'm gonna pause the stream. I'm gonna see if I can move. Ooh, hello. Sorry, hold on. There we go. Sorry, I'm like, I'm messing with my, my stream overlay. So I can like try and get the chat a little bit closer to my main screen where I'm actually playing the game. There we go. That's better. That is a lot better. I gotta I gotta sit down and get that managed so I can have like my activity feed as well. So I can make sure I don't miss any hydrates. Let me stay right over there. Actually, hold on, wasn't there Wait a minute. I think, yeah, right out here there was... Oh, I thought that was like... Uh, uh, uh. Since a little help your way. Did you DM me something? Yes, you did. Hi! How are you? <laughs> you are getting way too close for comfort. Okay, Kaza sent me a full, like, instruction manual on how to survive a bear attack, I guess. Hello, Steven. Is that the bear's name? Are we naming the bear Steven? Can we slip through here? Yes, we can. Alright, Ye old Bear is now named Steven. Can't let him near me. Oh fuck. Hi Steven. Don't mind me. You're minding me. Okay. Can we go back? Yes, we can. Really just stopped right in front of the little hole that I was at. Well, I guess while he's over there... Of course I can't search him. See, he's such a friendly name for such a violent animal. He really is.
but somehow I feel like Steven's a good name for this bear. Just, can you, can you fucking move though, Steven? Yeah, there you go. Stephen's trying to soft lock you. Stephen is actually a conscious AI that is sick and tired of being walked over by the player. So he's just gonna try and fuck me up. Steven is currently the most intelligent learning AI available right now. And he's just big, scary, fucking murderous bear. Hmm. There's a strangely Steven sized hole. Painkillers. Antiseptic, bandage, dead guy. What have we here? Emergency stem, torn paper. Lights game we had to leave. So you might stop here on your old trail. Did you grab the park in the first room? Uh, in the first room, like at the very beginning of the game, or the park in the first room of the cave? Uh, because if you're talking about the park in the first room of the cave, I didn't. Is good, just like I remembered. Yada yada yada. Don't care. Cave? No. <laughs> no, I did not. Oh, wait, my fucking. I'm missing some pants. Steven took my fucking pants. Yeah, I didn't see a parka in the, in the first room. Good because I lied to you. Stay back, you ass. Like I'm, I'm always kind of conscious about missing out on stuff. <laughs> you can't, you can't do that to me. Hello, Steven. Okay, he's going the other way. I think Steven knows I'm here. I got the... I, I'm getting bad music. Speaking of music, do I have my music playing? I totally have my music playing, don't I? <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, this is, uh, this is not the game that I want music playing on. This is the one time I can use superior game knowledge to bully you. Fuck you. But at the same time, you know, I, I understand. Fuck, he knows, he knows, he knows, he knows. Hey, Steven. Okay, so I can't kind of swing wide like I was doing before. I gotta go there. Yeah, you just keep your back turned, Steven. There's nothing going on. Okay, we're good. We're good. Everything's fine. Nobody's panicking. I gotta go all the way over there. Fuck. Stealth walking past the bear. See, stealth walking past bears is not my forte. Especially, like, in Skyrim, I always kill the bear. In, like, the opening sequence with, like, the cave and shit, I always kill the bear. It's 
do a little. Okay, we're going. We're going. Bro, fuck, fuck this. Oh. There it is. Oh, the ye spear. old bear killing spear. Somehow I gotta grab it. Not leaving the odds. Yeah, sure. All right, how the fuck am I supposed to get to that spear? Hi, Steven. Steven is going to wield it against you. That'll be the fucking day. That'd be a really good clip, though. I can do like this weird crouch spam thing. I move a little bit faster. There we go. We gotta get to that spear. That spear is literally life right now. Ooh. Hi, Steven. Yeah, you... you go... Don't... stop coming this way. Go a different way. Hey. He's just fucking lingering in, like, the same area. This is some bullshit. Hey, now. There's nothing for you over here, Steven. Steven spins fast enough, he'll take off. Fucking flying bears out here, dude. Canada sucks. I think he's closer to my right. Hi, Steven. How am I doing health-wise? I haven't checked. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, now Steven's over there. Oh, I'm, he's probably heading back this way now. Fucking Steven, just go piss off somewhere else so I can get my spear. Killing me, man. Yeah, health is on the bottom. I was just making sure that we didn't have any afflictions, but. Ooh. No need for menu. Yeah, valid. Cause I don't think you were there for it before, but um, last uh, long dark stream, I was dealing with food poisoning for like an hour. <laughs> I accidentally, I, I, for like a split second, I thought the space bar was the button to so like pick up an item after you interact with it, and I ate like half of a raw venison steak. Fucking Steven, piss off! In there. All right. Glad to know I'm not the only idiot in the room. Do a little dance. Do a little dance. Except it was wolf flesh. Gave you worms. Ooh. It's kind of gross. Alright, we'll dip down in here. Emergency stim, painkillers. Okay, a lot of medical stuff. I think the game is assuming that uh, I'm gonna be getting hit. Or like attacked by the bear, but so far, 
I'm just playing like a massive pussy, and it's paying off. Steven? Gotcha. I got the fucking spear, boys! Come on, punk ass! Let's do this! Let's do this! Oh, how the turntables! Fuck you! Fuck you! <sighs> Bitch. Okay, we good? We good? We fine? Limbs are still attached. Round two. We're killing this fucking bear. There we go. It's going for my pants. It might fuck up my clothes, yeah. What's up? What's up, you wanna go again? Wanna go again? We're going again. Yeah! <laughs> Rah! Man, kill bear! Bitch! I'm... I'm sorry. The hell I am! That was awesome! Such a majestic creature. I didn't want to kill mm. you. I wanted world, to kill you. Will make murderers of us all. Thank you for keeping me alive, Oliver. Oh, I can't <gasps> skin it? That's Kenzie. fucking sucked. I killed a bear. The bear is dead. I killed it. I killed it. Did the bear? Change the but yo. What's up, Sarah? Somebody hi somebody say hi to Sarah for me in the chat really quick so I don't have to freeze the game. Good. You're up. And just in time. What happened? Because <laughs> I'm working, it's me, not Past you. Time. Okay, that's that's relieving. I'll let you rest since I needed time to fix the radio. Ah, and what did I tell you? Those transponder parts did the trick. They were perfect. You did good, Mackenzie. Did good. Yeah, real fucking good. I killed the I killed like a bear. It be sufficient, but who knows how long it'll last with this unpredictable aurora in the sky. Okay. So can we call Perseverance Mills? I've already set the frequency. Just toggle the call button and cross your fingers. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna see if all this effort was worth it. Hello? Is this the radio station at Perseverance Mills? She was muted the whole time. Hello? What do you mean quarantine? Is there a doctor with you? Oh, Can you come on? Damn it! No! Damn it! I... I'm sorry, Jeremiah. That was my only chance. Only chance for what? You need to find your lady friend. I need to reach someone too. And that was my only chance. Well, we can find another radio, or repair this one. Get new parts. No. There's only one way now. You need to do it. Me? Need to do what? You need to take my message. You need to deliver it for me. It's important. You need to do it for me, Mackenzie. It'll be weeks before I can travel that far. You need to do it for me, Mackenzie. 
Okay, okay, take it easy. You don't understand. You don't understand what's coming, Mackenzie. You have to take my message, or else none of the rest of it matters. Okay, Jeremiah, I'll take your message. It's only a little detour for you. On the way to Perseverance Mills, a little detour that can change yeah, I'll a lot. See, see, didn't know there's like a killer of plants in our backyard. Yeah, I've seen something about Listen. that. Yeah, Go this guy's definitely like you'll need to get fucking the tweaking system working. With the Aurora, it just might work. Go through Carter, the lower part of the dam. Now look out for yeah, I know. Unstable. Right. Through Carter, out the other side. You'll find your way to Signal Hill. Old weather service radio there. More powerful than my shortwave. You should be able to reach them. Reach who? I'll give you the frequency. Ask for Atwood. Atwood. Got it. I hope I don't have to remember that. What's the message? Wintermute. Wintermute? Yeah. Just that. Atwood will know what it means. Once you've done that, keep following the road north and you'll eventually get to Perseverance Mills. Okay, Atwood Winter Hill. A few days walk out. Okay. Oh. Okay. Got it. And what will you do? A couple more days to recover, and then something else I gotta or do. Or winter, whatever it was. I already You're forgot. No Fuck. State. I forgot what the it's message was. It's a short trip. But one I gotta take. And with the old bear out of the picture, I may have half a chance now. Thanks to you. Well... Don't make all my hard work. Go nuts, yeah. All right, thanks for being here, Oliver. Good luck finding your lady, Mackenzie. I hope she's okay. This upside down world won't be easy on the. Oh people. God! <laughs> Come on! Thank thanks. you for keeping me alive, Oliver. You take care now. She's out there somewhere, and she's a strong yeah. one. She'll make it, and I'll find her again in Perseverance Mills. Don't forget about Atwood. I won't forget about Take Atwood. Take care of yourself, Jeremiah. Oh, is she going to send me straight to the dam? Nope. Well, that sucks. Get into the dam at night when the aurora is in the sky. Wow, my fucking toke is fun. It's just, it's all busted. Yeah, I can't, uh, I can't repair it, so I just gotta harvest it. Oh, I got all my shit back. Bears, am I right? Damn straight. These are fucking nuts. Can I dip back inside where it's warm so I can repair my clothes? I'm done with him. Man! Time to move on. Locked my ass out. Alright, I guess we'll head down to... What is this? Got up real easy for a bear attack. Eh, yeah. Just some torn up clothes. All my limbs are still attached, though. All right, we'll head to the camp office, get a fire going, hopefully, and uh, we'll see if we can patch up some of our clothes. What is this? This is probably stuff that I dropped. I'll leave that there. Very convenient placing for uh, some clothes that I didn't want, though, because I needed a new piece of uh, headwear. Mystery Lake is your favorite area. I mean, I, I I can't say which area is my favorite just yet. Because I've still got a lot to go through. Let's see. I don't know if I'm going to investigate all that. 
I'm gonna love prison, like prison the map, or like prison as in I'm going to prison. The map? Okay, cool. Figures. Yeah, I've seen pictures and it looks like a lot of fun. Although I don't know how well they're going to take to me killing one of their people already. God damn, this is hell. Oh, it's... I assume the prison's gonna be a little rough. I think, actually, no. Probably not a little rough. I'll live. It's a shame I lost my spear. I was, uh, I was quite fond of the old bear-killing spear. What is this? A stack of papers? I probably dropped that at some point. Never had a good time in prison. I don't think prison is where you're supposed to go for good times. Unless you're like a certain kind of person. But, you know, that's neither here nor there. Rock. Oh, hello. Can't feel my hands. You're fine. You'll see. I mean, I will, hopefully, if I can actually get to the, uh, the next episode. <clears throat> Anything cool in here? Ooh, wood stove. I might actually need this. Oh, I have no tinder. Let me, uh, let me fix that really quick. I just need to get a, a small fire that I can warm my bones with, and we'll get going. But, uh, as soon as we can get onto the railroad tracks... Just realized you need to wait for an Aurora. Yeah, I think that's going to be All the right. harder bit. Because I don't know how frequently they show up. Oh. Fantastic. Oh, they're rare? How fucking long am I going to be here? Ain't, uh, ain't exactly what I was planning. Not very rare, but they are rare. I see, I see. Well, maybe the game will smile upon me and, like, give me a higher chance of getting an Aurora so I can get out of here. But, uh, until then, I guess I just gotta hang around the dam. I just hope that a, uh, an Aurora shows up. What can you do? Alright, railroad tracks should be right up here. And I guess since it's midday, I think we'll be good to go ahead and run over in the direction of the dam and see if there's like... I'm sure there's at least enough food and water up there to keep me going for a little bit. But uh, if we end up waiting for a while, might have to resort to fishing, hunting the works. Speaking of hunting... Hello. There's a, there's a deer over there. I might, uh... I might partake very quickly. 
do side quests while I wait? Yeah, I mean, I have, uh, like, I have the supply cache and this one here. You know what? Fuck it. I'm, I'm already nearby. I've already, like, I can do this lake gunshot things. Hello. Don't mind me, I'm not gonna shoot you yet. But if you hang around, I might need to. See, this place is a little freaky, because it looks a lot, like, smaller on the outside. But it's, it's pretty spacious in there, I like it. Alright, away we get. And hopefully we don't fall through the ice like we did a few times last stream. Um, yeah, I did hang around in that place for a little while. Yeah, so if we just kind of keep heading in this direction. Keep our eyes... Well, I don't, I don't really resort to seeing the thing. You can definitely tell whenever you're about to fall through the ice. It'll scare the piss out of you. But if this, uh... This lake wasn't, you know... Pretty sturdy in terms of ice. I don't think people would build these little huts on it. Alright, what do you got for me? Uh, tinder plug? Ice fishing hole. Oh, I can bust it open. Granola bar. This stuff will come in handy. Fishing honestly might not be that bad of an idea. And we have all the means to do it. But we'll hold off for now. Unless it's a better idea. It's probably a better idea to start as soon as possible and just save the the regular foods and stuff that you don't have to catch or anything for an emergency. But that sounds like smart people stuff, and smart is the last thing I am. Ooh, them's just wolves. Hunting just knife. What I need. I can finally get rid of this fucking piece of shit. Reclaimed wood. Rifle ammunition. Alright, let's go uh, head this way, because this is where our side quest is, and there's a couple houses over here that I want to go check out. I know the side quest had something to do with gunshots, so I'm expecting bodies. And bodies have loot on them, and loot is something I like. Hello, sir. Do you need any assistance? Shit. Looks like someone found trouble. This will come in handy. Y'all, I don't want to jump to conclusions, but I think that guy's dead back there. Okay, blood leads... in there. So naturally, we will avoid that place at all costs until... we've searched everything else. There's the front door. Oh, I have the key? <laughs> Who spilled the juice? <laughs> Elise, hello! How are you guys doing? Thank you for the raid. How was Skyrim? Hmm. 
Yeah, it's a lot of hello. Pretty good. You get any uh get into any long scuffles with vampires? How's the long dark? It's it's going pretty well. Killed a bear. So sorry you guys missed that. That was uh, that was definitely something. Oh, hello, flares. Yeah, right now it's we're really just playing the uh, the waiting game because uh, we need to we need to wait for an aurora to get stuff working. At this time, doing the companions quest line, dealing with a faction that doesn't like the companions. Oh, right, the silver something. I don't know. It's been so long since I played Skyrim. Companions quest line is one of my personal favorites, though. I like I love all the characters. Silver hands, that's right. I was gonna say the silver swords. But I don't know. I felt that was wrong. And look at me go. I was right. I was right that I was gonna be wrong. However that works. I've thought about getting back into Skyrim recently, but I've played through like the base game so much. Um there is oh, I'll pause the game so I don't freeze death. There is kind of a uh kind of like an overhaul for Skyrim. It's called Enderall. Uh, the Lost something. It's through Steam. I really think you should check it out. But uh, if I decide to get back into Skyrim anytime soon, I will definitely be uh, taking a look at Enderall. Ooh, cutscene. Leave me alone. I'm not opening this door for anyone. It's okay. I I'm not here to take anything from you. Are you with the Forest Talkers? Forest Talkers. I am, but I'm not letting you in. They killed my friend. How do I know you want something on your to playlist as well? You don't. It looks very not. promising. Name's Mackenzie. And I'm way too stubborn to just leave you out here all by yourself. You'll have to trust me. Seems like I don't have much of a choice. We left most of our supplies. I have no idea who this guy is. I'm I'm currently just doing can side quests. I can try. There's more. In that abandoned dam, we found evidence that proves there shouldn't be logging in Mystery Lake. I need that evidence. Documents nobody wanted to be found. We hid them until we could retrieve them. Under a floor tile at the bottom of the stairwell. If you can help me get oh the documents Oh my god, he back, just keeps going, doesn't well, he? Well, it'd be a huge win for the environment. If you care about, you know, living in the world. I have a feeling the world has bigger problems right now, but I'll see what I can do. Here's the key to the trailer where we stashed our supplies. I'll Come slide on. it under the door. Let's, let's get this over with. Had to raid and run, sadly. Went way over my stream end time. These get dinner going. Totally understand. You take it easy, Elise. Yeah, take care of yourself. Long streams require long breaks. But thanks again for the raid. And you, uh, you have yourself a lovely day. Where am I going now? Have I come across any raccoons? No, but a lot of bears and a lot of wolves. A few deer. But unfortunately, no. No raccoons. Speak of the devil, there's those wolves I saw earlier. I'd like to head that way. Hmm. Uh, we'll see if we can kind of head the opposite direction of these guys. But no, unfortunately, no raccoons. Honestly, I have no idea if they're in the game. Which would be kind of disappointing. I don't like how close they are. I'm gonna laugh, it's the Aurora tonight. Honestly, that's what I'm hoping for. Because we've been on... Episode 2 for two streams now, and I got through episode 1 in just one stream. So we're kind of... We're running a little bit behind schedule right now. And I would very much like to take a bite out of episode 3 before, uh, before the end of this stream. Okay. Uh, we should be able to kind of cut through here to like this frozen river bit and get to that stash. I'm going to make a prediction that there's going to be nothing good in it, like all the other stashes, but I kind of need to burn daylight. By the way, I think you picked up a good jacket earlier. You know, I probably did and then forgot about it. Let me, uh, let me take a look. 
Um, it's better than my ragged military coat, but uh, that's just because it's full of holes. And I got a new hat as well. And I will be wearing that. We'll, uh, we'll get back through everything and we'll kind of repair all of my good clothes. Once we get to a place of relative safety. But right now I don't want to get jumped by wolves. Kind of a, a bad way to go after killing a big ass bear. time is it? Let's see, it's currently... It's kind of hard to see because, like, I have my, uh, my event thing overlay over, like, the, the time thing, but it's currently midday right now, so... Sun should be going down soon. We'll see. I hear a lot of wolves, and I'm getting uncomfy. Oh, yeah, there they are. I got plenty of bullets, so if things go sideways, I don't think I have to worry too much. I just gotta hit my shots, which is already asking for a lot. Okay. Let's kind of hold the left here. Yeah, I shouldn't cross paths with that one. Shouldn't being a very big wolf jacket time. Can I get one of those? Because if I can get a wolf jacket, I'm gonna kill every wolf I can find. I kinda I kinda need the warmth right now. Ooh, hello. Tough, not very filling, but edible. Alright, I'll take that. Uh, is it up there? It's totally up there. Uh, yep. Alright, we're on the right path. Don't know if it's unlocked in the store. You can check crafting, though. I don't think I have anything like that. No. So maybe it's a blueprint I have to unlock at some point. Maybe I've already passed by it and I can't learn it again. Which wouldn't surprise me in the slightest. Oh, there's a hunting blind down there. A lot of rabbits and a lot of deer. That's it. We'll focus on the stash for now. And now we aren't really struggling for food. But you just wait. We'll get there. Here we go. Well, well. What do we have here? Military grade MRE. I'll die if water I bottle, water. a ton of coffee. Alright, actually, yeah, that was pretty good. Make you two OP. Oh, I assume the uh the wolf pelt jacket is pretty good then. Yeah. Gotta keep things challenging. Keep me on my toes. I hate to disturb the wildlife here, but uh, I would like to see what's in this hunting blind. Kind of crouch down so we can avoid causing a ruckus. Rifle cartridges. There's a snare down here, I but I don't see myself it. using that. I'll take it anyways, because it never hurts to have extra equipment. And then we will try our best to just sneak out of here. In survival, you can make clothes out of every animal. So you can go like full on mountain man, huh? I might have to give that a go, like maximum difficulty. See how I fare. I mean, I'm already struggling as is. You know, not right now, but I've had my... I've had my fair share of close calls. Alright, shouldn't be too much further until the dam. We still got a lot of daylight left, so I th think I might push for 
getting this uh this side quest finished. We'll see though. We'll see. Yeah, an interloper playthrough. I'll last like an hour tops. If I'm being entirely honest with you. But that's just part of the fun. And I'm sure it'll be slightly entertaining at the very least. Hello. Goodbye. Give me ten minutes. <laughs> Gotta have a little faith in me, man. I'm not as bad at this game as you might think I am, but I will not deny the fact that I am pretty bad at this game. I have no idea how long it's going to take to get an Aurora. Because if they're, like, relatively rare, unless, like, it's just going to line up the story that I get one tonight. No, we might have to sit around and starve for a few days. And personally, I'm not looking forward to that. But, you know, can't have everything. Let's see. Uh, I think I might have to actually dip around this way, because that looks like mountains. And I'd rather not sprain my ankle again, because that's always a pain. I think I've looted this thing for all it's worth. But there is... Moldy Granola Bar. I think I'll pass on that, thanks. Yeah, I've already been here. We'll keep going. What's that sign say? Oh, it's it's an image. It's like a a bus. There's wolves somewhere nearby, I can hear those things. Oh, it's a truck. I don't think any trucks are going to be rolling through here anytime soon, so I think we'll be okay. There's another deer over there. I think there's just like an overabundance of deer right now because I haven't been killing any. I think I've killed one deer ever since I started this playthrough. And at least five wolves. So right around in, like, this direction is where we need to be heading to get this, uh, this side quest finished. There should also be a stash over here as well. Might be a giant waste of time, but maybe we can get lucky like we did with this other stash that we got. Get, like, an MRE, something good. I think this is it right here. Another deer. I've also noticed something, and it's not really that important, I guess. But it is something I've noticed. There are only bucks out here. There are no doe. What do we got out here? I'm hearing more footsteps. Is there another deer around here? Yes, there is. Okay. Just wanted to be sure. Never be too careful. Hmm. Uh, I'll take that. Oh. Fucking A. We got a spray and risk. It's fine. We'll just drop it in here. Uh, you weigh the most. You can go. We'll go ahead and drop that as well. Alright, we can't take much, because we're already nearing over we encumbrance here? right now. But we'll take what we what we need. Horn wolf scarf. I think we're good on headwear right now. 
Work pants. Need those. Work boots. I don't think I need those. I think my boots are in good condition. I could use this. Alright, let's take a look at our clothes. Let's see if we already got those on. Oh, never mind. Our work boots are not doing too hot. Oh, okay. I need a cured gut and a cured rabbit pelt to fix my mittens. Which is less than ideal, but not terrible. Alright, let's see if we can get this thing repaired. The, the military jacket is really, really good. Alright, we're actually burning daylight a lot faster now that we're repairing stuff. Fantastic. Alright, and I guess we can drop this, maybe. Thank you for keeping me alive, cause. I think we'll yeah, we'll get rid of this. Hydrating game. Oh yeah. Probably should do that. Uh, I think I can get rid of this as well. Just don't want to carry a bunch of unnecessary stuff. Jesus. Let's see if we can repair this. Oh yeah, I am really thirsty. Let's see what I can do about that. Uh, and now what we have left is some potable water. This stuff will come in handy. Don't need those. Alright, that's it for this building. Oh no. So we're looking for some kind of note, and I assume it'll be in one of these buildings. but I am frequently wrong about many things. So I'm not going to get my hopes up. Another storm lantern. I don't think I need another one of those. Revolver Doesn't ammunition. Definitely hold on to that. Okay, nothing else in here. And there is a stash somewhere. Okay, this is the building. 100%. It's made of soup. Nothing here. I think I can use this. Hmm. Lantern might be handy for the Hydra Dam. Uh, I, yeah, I already have a, a Storm Lantern right now. That's why I didn't want to take it. Because it's just extra weight that I don't really need. Although the Fishing Line and Tackle doesn't really weigh much. Hello. Forest Talker Supplies. Alright, I'll take that. Climbing socks. I've already got two pairs of climbing socks. Police mittens, trail boots. Yes. What? I'll drink that. All right, we are doing good. All right, let's uh compare our boots really quick. Uh. Not a big difference. We'll go ahead and drop these. God tier moose print. Alright, I mean, if you say it's so good, I'll go ahead and repair it and we'll see. We're in a place that has beds, so if we really need to, we can just kind of sleep. Oh, yeah, that is pretty good. Go ahead and harvest this. 
And get that last repair going. Fantastic. Alright, it is now dark. Uh, do we have an Aurora? Oh. Guess we still don't know. Let's, uh, let's go check for that stash. And if we don't have an Aurora, we can, uh, just head over here to the dam. Honestly, I didn't expect to get all these little side quest things done so quickly. Also, I do apologize if you can hear the dogs in the background. I cannot control them. Okay, I'm assuming... Yep, I can already see it. It's that little box right there. Alright, what you got for me? Found it. What have we here? Firearm cleaning kits? I found all the forest talker caches. Ragged ski gloves. Well, all right. Look at me doing things. All right, I think we'll we'll hold off on putting those on until we can get them repaired. And I think we're just gonna go ahead and beeline it straight for the dam and just make the most of the situation. Can I actually... Hold on. Can I open these? I cannot. I'm only slightly disappointed. Hopefully the, uh, the wolves that I heard earlier around this area are kind of cleared out. Because fighting wolves in the daylight is hard enough, but fighting wolves in the dark... To be honest, I'd rather not. Uh, but I don't think we're going to be getting an Aurora tonight, which is very unfortunate. So we will have to spend a little bit more time in this region, but I don't think it's going to kill anybody except for me. I, I need to... Tomato soup. Uh, like the cattail stalks. It's not terrible, actually. I expect that to be a lot worse. I'll eat the stale granola bar as well. Alright. That should hold us up until we get to the dam. Once we get there, we can maybe set up, like, a snare trap. Cattails are low for food. I, I will definitely take note of that. I don't know if there's, like, a way that I can, like, prepare and maybe, like, cook them at all. It's where they're a little bit more nutritious. I highly doubt it. Okay, as far as I can tell, if my hearing's not going to fail me, uh, the wolves are mostly, like, on my right here. So they've walked past. You just gotta eat them raw. Fair enough. Gotta do what you gotta do. Like God intended. Whatever you say, man. So I really just need to wait for an Aurora. Cam Nida. Hello, Mets. How are you doing, bud? You, uh, you haven't joined into anything groundbreaking. We're mostly just kind of waiting for an Aurora to happen so I can get electricity. Doing alright? Just gorge yourself on pasta? What kind of pasta? I assume it wasn't just straight up pasta. I'm hearing a lot of wolves. Like an uncomfortable amount of wolves. 
Kill Steven. Yes, I did kill Steven. I have no idea if you know who Steven is, but I killed Steven. That's a fire. I don't remember a fire being there. And the gate's open. <laughs> the MGRJR Deluxe. Alright, context. Uh, me and my friends, we have a, we have a buddy of ours. Uh, his name, he used to call himself MGRJR as a username. And he used to eat the most bland foods ever. Oh, it's Santa! What up, Santa? Oh, Mackenzie! So you're still alive. Goddamn right. Methuselah, you appear in the strangest places. You've left your mark and have overcome great odds so far. Butter but on spaghetti noodles. Hey, butter noodles fucking hit. Still hold some secrets. I'm not sure this is the right time for... There are still stories that need to be told if you wish to play a part in them. There is always time for that. But if you are in a hurry, by all I means, go. Yeah, cause Nobody did just call your ass you out. For continuing your journey onward. You know, it's been a hell of a slog out there. Never mind that damn bear. I've nearly died more times than I care to count. It couldn't have been easy for you either. But you seem strangely calm about the hostility. I really of this didn't. Place. I do not appreciate it. I have wandered these paths a long time, friend. I was a walker. Now, I'm a watcher. I'm here to observe these times and help where I may. As strange as it is to run into you again, it's good to find a familiar face in all this frigid wilderness. And keep to your paths. If this is a reckoning, as you say, I hope ours cross again. I love you, Santa. Okay, so what are we doing up here? I like seeing my quests. Old bear no longer a risk. Get into the dam at night when the aurora is in the sky. Can't do that yet. What is this? Okay, these are like actual side quests, side quests. Go to the dam, retrieve the document, search for under... Search under a loose tile at the bottom of the stairs leading to the admin area. I see. Let's see, we already did the mystery like supply caches. Survival school. Work through the survival school lessons. Sounds like a lot of work. Alright, what do we got? Fucking darkness. Alright. We'll, uh, we'll use the lantern for as long as we can, but we do not have a ton of fuel left for this thing. Guys, thank you for keeping me alive. Do that really quick. There we go. That'll come. Oh, the wool toke. I think that's actually a higher durability than one of the ones I have, or a higher condition. I'm about to be so hydrated. May you don't even understand. I don't know if you were there for um my my first affiliate stream, but oh my god, I got I got over hydrated. It was insane. I'm. Don't, uh, don't go too crazy, guys. Okay, so, right, stairs. I forgot we were looking for stairs leading up to the admin. Uh, it says it was on a tile, so I guess we're looking for tile floors. Okay, well, this is not it. 
so we already passed by it. It was pretty crazy. Uh, I don't think it's here. Is it further down? Wait, 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 wait. Yes! Forest Talker documents. That's a lot of words. There you are. Alright, um, hold on. I'm sitting up straight. Don't get on my ass. You can bully me with push-ups whenever I get those enabled. I gotta do that. I just need your permission to do so, so I'm not stealing your idea. But, like, it's fucking genius. Alright, this is where I found the flare gun. I think we need to find a place where we can kind of just hunker down for a minute. Excellent. Sorry, I thought I saw something. You can do planks and wall sits. I cannot remember what was down here. Except for a dead guy. And locked gate. How incredibly exciting. Are there beds here? I can't remember if there's beds here. If there's not, I can just like put down a um a whatchamacallit sleeping bag. I totally forgot that sleeping bags were a thing. I'll take that. Alright, let's... Go check out the other floors really quick. There's gotta be somewhere with, like, a bed. Probably not. I think I'm getting my hopes up for a place that shouldn't have beds. I forgot how much stuff I dropped around here. Stale granola bars. Hello, Joel. How you doing, buddy? Hope you're doing all right. Ooh, unsearched trash can. I think you walked past the spare rifle. I'm not gonna let you bullshit me again. We'll duck down in here, and I guess we're gonna kind of just wait the night out in here. Okay, we'll extinguish this. Uh, I'm doing fine, Joel. Thank you for asking. Okay, I can't see a damn thing, but we'll try and sleep through the night. I get so comfy filled. Yeah, I'm gonna be freezing to death on the floor of a dam. And honestly, I feel like that's the best time to get some sleep. It's a boy who cried wolf situation. It is. You tried to trick me by saying that was a part there was a park guy I missed, and now I'm not gonna trust your ass. There we go. Now we can see things. I bet it is fucking frigid outside. Ooh, who would have guessed? Alright, so we gotta go all the way back down here so we can go talk to the forest walker guy. Hello, Santa. Didn't see any rifle, but then again, I wasn't paying any attention. Fair enough. I don't blame you. I was looking more for a bed than a uh, than a rifle. Can I, oh, I can cook things. 
let me cook some tomato soup. I was leaning on a wall. Well, in all fairness, I don't need another rifle. I think the one rifle I have already is perfectly fine. Alright. We got tomato soup cooking. We got snow melting. We are fucking thriving out here, y'all. Drink that. And we are going to be... Ooh, yeah, we'll, we'll be on our way. We'll go. Dude, I cannot even imagine how, like, how much it'll fucking hit to get, like, a warm bowl of tomato soup in a fucking freeze like this. Or just, like, any warm food in general, but tomato soup, it's just, it's, I think that'd be, like, an out-of-body experience. I'm gonna get my gun out. I feel unsafe. As this guy hasn't frozen yet because he's Santa. Oh, very unprofessional of me, but um, because I don't know how to do the shout out function, it makes me look like a total moron. But I'll figure it out eventually. Until then, you're just gonna have to go by my word. Go check out May IRL. She does some. I totally just lost my train of thought. Hold on. Give me two seconds. She does some Skyrim streams. Very cool person. Uh, she's been hanging around for a while. But yeah. Got, got good content. Good people. Go give her a look. I apologize for completely blanking out on my, my mini shadow. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you for keeping me alive, Joel. Let me see if I can... Let me see if I can one-hand this while I walk. Oh shit, I'm walking to this thing. You're very welcome, eh? Yeah, fucking, I just, I just put my water bottle down. Alright, let me see if I can do this again. I'm like having to undo the cap and everything one-handed. There we go. I did it. Still don't know how to navigate Twitch. I, I kind of understand that. I've been I've been getting better, and now that I'm actually using the stream manager, like from the desktop, it's been getting a lot easier. But there's still some stuff that I don't know how to do, so I'm gonna have to figure out the whole shoutout system thing. I think we might have to hunker down for a second and get a fire going, so don't freeze to death. Do I have anything I can start a fire with? Yes. We can get like a small fire. Maybe. Eh, right here will do. Right on the ice. Looks like it worked. I have no fuel I can put in here because I am stupid. Legit do shout out name of streamer. Well, hey, you learn something new every day. Cause I sure as shit didn't know that before. They don't exactly hand this stuff out to you whenever you start streaming, you know. So my apologies for not knowing what I'm doing. They just toss you right in. They really do. Fire's not worth it. It really wasn't. But you know, it's just, it's good for morale.
<laughs> blind leading the blind type beat. And we'll just go. We'll just go. I've saved myself like a few seconds. But hopefully we can find some place that's a little bit warmer. And uh, we'll, we'll warm up our bones so we don't freeze to death. I know there's um, there's a second cabin down by this uh, this map marker. So we'll we'll see if we can kind of camp out there because I assume the guy who was leading blood everywhere, uh, I don't think he'll want to be friends with us. So he won't be sharing any fires or nothing nothing very welcoming. Cold is making my head feel thick. You're fine. Oh, I missed a rock. Oh, hi. <laughs> you good, bro? This stuff will come Wood matches. Convict journal entry. Beef jerky, fuck yeah. Appreciate it, dude. Later. He's dead? Nah. I could eat anything right now. Oh, I've got a hypothermia risk. Who would have guessed? <laughs> Bro, I thought he was playing Remnant with the warm stone. Nah, dude, warm stones are red. That was just a normal so stone. Cold. You're fine. Maybe he'd be less cold if he'd actually put on his gloves. Colorblind? I don't think, uh, I don't think it works that way. I'm not a professional, but I don't think somebody can see rocks as red just because they're colorblind. Although, I am more than happy to have you prove me wrong. Okay, it's uh, it's starting to get a little bit... A little bit more than I can handle out here. We'll be fine. We'll manage. These red rocks is gray. Oh, I don't. Uh, I don't think it works that way. Well, maybe. Maybe. Like I said, I'm no professional. You can't ask me about colorblind stuff. As far as I know, I can see colors just fine. Do a colorblind test right now? Maybe. I don't know. I feel like I'd rather live without knowing that I'm colorblind. Because I feel like that's a lot funnier. We'll get a small fire going really quick. Warm my bones. Maybe do a little bit of fishing while we're here. Depending on how long we can get this fire to go. Fuck. Alright. We'll try again. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, I'm out of tinder. God damn it. I don't think I can make tinder either. I don't have anything to make it. Nope. I've got nothing to make tinder with. Well, that sucks. Can I freezing. Light a match, maybe? Will that keep me at least a little warm?
Yeah, this isn't doing shit. Alright, we'll just keep going. It's not much further anyways. We'll just keep piking through the blizzard and hope for the best. I do need to eat something very soon. But uh, those MREs should keep me set for at least a little while. Oh, there's the dead guy. Which means, yep, there's the docks and the houses should be coming up just outside. Yeah, here we go. We made it to our destination. Hello? I've got your supplies and those documents you wanted here. Hey, that's great. Thank you. But I hope you understand if I ask you to just leave them outside the door. I have plenty of ammo. Right. I'll uh, leave it all here for you, just like you asked. Thank you, stranger. You may not care, but you've made a huge difference to our cause. All right. Well, I hope we did a good thing. I could eat anything. Okay. Uh, there is nowhere to start a fire in here. Awesome. We're, we're warming up at least a little bit, though, so I think if we can just wait it out, maybe sleep, we'll be okay. Some coffee that I'm never going to uh, use. Yeah, it didn't do too much. Uh, beef jerky from a dead guy. Good enough. And uh, I can't start fires inside. So I'm kind of boned right now. I could see if I could make a break for the camp office. Got that beef trick. I don't like the way that you're using quotations around beef. So I'm going to choose to ignore it. Uh, I am going to take these sacks of papers because I can make tinder out of that. I, I think going for the camping lodge might be in my best interest. beef on my jerky. Ah, dude, you got it backwards. She's be she's jerking on my beef. Okay, it's not blizzarding anymore. Oh, we already took the fucking stuff. Hey, you still alive in there? Yeah, I'm still weak. Gonna rest up here until I'm ready to move on. <laughs> oh, I'm getting a phone call from Oklahoma City. I'm going to ignore that. I guess we'll just try and rest up. I just, I don't know. I don't know about this place specifically. I think we are going to go for the camping lodge. Tells me, are you calling me from Oklahoma City? Like, I, I, I know it's like spam calls. Because I was getting calls from Oklahoma City for like a week before I blocked the number. 
and now I'm getting multiple calls from the same place, just with, like, slightly varying phone numbers. Just, you can't escape it, man. City of the Oklahomans. Oh, I forgot there's wolves over there. Oh, but there's more cabins. My fingers feel numb. You're fine. Okay, you know what? I'm feeling particularly violent right now. Oh! You got fucked up, bro. Skill issue. A lot more of these little huts around here. We'll uh, we'll do some looting that we might go break apart that uh, that wolf. Ooh. Oh, hold on. Can I? Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, I know exactly what we are doing. We're going to fucking camp out in here. Someplace to escape this cold. Well, uh, we'll do some more looting, and then we're gonna we're gonna get ourselves nice and cozy in that little fishing lodge. Do some late night fishing. We'll get a nice fire going. Be really fucking cozy. What do we got in here? Hopefully we can get some more reclaimed wood so we can keep that fire going for a while. Uh, not reclaimed wood, but even better. Oh, and this reclaimed wood. Okay. Oh yeah. This is the stuff. Wolf and fish for dinner. Dude, that's the fucking dinner of kings right there. This will come in handy. Not missing anything cool. And away we go. Hopefully we'll get some more campfire fuel from this place. It might be in my best interest to take out the rest of these wolves before I hit the hay. Hmm. Last thing I need is one chasing after me during the night. I'll give him a chance, though. Oh. Last time I ever do that. Sorry, bud. Hold on. <laughs> wait, wait a second. I just fucking get shit on. All right, moving on. Wind's starting to pick up again. Uh, but we're currently at midday. So we still have some sunlight to burn. Just teabagged your dinner? It might be my dinner. I already killed that other one. Are all these locked? This one's not locked. Fantastic. Alright, what do we got? Wool mittens. Could end up being Celerant. useful. Celerant is always nice. Tomato soup. 
couple books, stack of papers, simple notes. That's another hidden supply cache that we gotta go check out. I think I might take all these books just for fuel. Yeah. This pack is getting kind of heavy. It'll be fine. All right, let's get back to our humble little abode. We are pretty over encumbered, but it won't be too terrible. We have one more wolf out here. So if it wants the smoke, it better start early before my uh, my hands start shaking and I miss my shots. You know what? You know what? we're we're gonna. Oh, I think I just grazed it. I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's get in here and drop off all of our stuff, and then we can start cutting up some of these wolves. Once we uh, kill the one that got away. Let me close that up. Alright, so we have got a reclaimed wood, some stacks of papers, cedar firewood, and a lot of books. All right. Yeah, we'll we'll be set for a, a pretty good amount of time. I don't know if we'll be able to kind of squeeze it through the entire night. And honestly, I have no idea why I'm trying to get set up in that small little cabin whenever the the big camping cabin is just like a short walk away. Like you can literally see it. It's right over there. Where'd that wolf go? Ooh, now I'm getting nervous. Alright, we'll, we'll forget about it. Damn. Freeze. Let's, uh, let's go get that fire going. Get the fire going, warm our bones, and uh, start cutting up some wolves for dinner. It probably bled out somewhere. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. Ah, you're fine. All right, let's get this bitch going. Started right up. Well, thank goodness for that. About four hours. Miss an animal to run for miles for some reason. I mean, I'm cool with that. I don't need that thing jumping me later tonight. Cook some tomato soup. Spider sense is so tingling. Hold on. Okay, never mind. False alarm. Oh shit! <laughs> I almost burned my fucking soup! Oh! Okay, cool. Uh, we're gonna go cut up that, uh, that wolf out here. Well, we'll just take the first one. We'll leave the other one because we really don't need it. 
That was uh, more of a self-defense thing. Alright, what do we need from you? We'll take all the meat you got. Take the hide, and we'll take some of the guts so we can get those cured and uh, try our best to repair. What the fuck is going on with my camera? What? <laughs> what the fuck? It's just, just going. Too much stuff to carry. All right, we're gonna ignore that. Yeah, I guess. Uh, I guess Mackenzie decided to partake in a little bit of daydreaming while he was cutting up the fucking wolf. We'll, uh, we'll see if we can get this cooked up, though. I think it's like on the other side of that hill somewhere. That last wolf. But uh, I ain't gonna worry too much about it. Okay, you'll be done in an hour and five minutes. So we'll fish for an hour. Because I've never fished before. I need to find food. Hey! Oh yeah, we are eating like fucking kings out here, boys. Alright, cook that whole fucking fish. Yeah, yeah! Okay, and I think I gotta drop some stuff really quick. Uh, what was it? I think it was... This and this. Oh wow, that's gotta dry for five, seven days. Yeah, we are. We're not coming back for that. We'll be fine. Oh shit! Did my fire already burn out? Oh, I don't have anything else to fuel that with. Well, I guess we're heading to the camping lodge. It was... Oh, wait, I should probably take my bedroll. That's, uh, that would have been bad. Too heavy. Eh, you're fine. Well, uh, we'll leave one of these wolf steaks out here. As a, as a treat. Maybe two, actually. Yeah, we'll leave. Two. We'll leave them two. Then they'll getting kind of thirsty. Eat whatever is left. That last wolf will come eat whatever is left and get some kind of disease. Playing the long game. Unless it decides to jump me right now, and if that's the case, I'm gonna fucking smoke that thing. Yeah, that's a deer. Where's that last wolf at, though? I don't see it. It must have gone quite a fair distance. And honestly, I respect that. I respect the shit out of that. Hopefully, we can get an Aurora tonight. I really just said nah, I'm out. I mean, yeah. I mean, if you got grazed by a fucking rifle round, I don't think you'd uh, be too eager to go back to where you got shot. So, in all fairness, I kind of understand where the where the wolf is coming from in his decision. But, uh, doesn't change the fact that I still want that motherfucker dead. Ooh, I'm popping my neck. 
My shit is getting stiff. Like I popped the I popped the left side of my neck, but like the right side is just like it's it's holding up on me. I have to get something to drink. Uh, I do not trust that. Drink this. Just for the time being. Okay, and there should be... Yep, here we go. Potbelly stove. We just gotta find ourselves some fuel. Something's gotta go. Uh, you'll be fine. Don't be a little bitch. Alright, let's start this fire. Got some reclaimed wood and some books to keep this thing going. Oh, I never noticed that there's a hatchet there. I might grab that. Depending on how my weight's looking, I might grab that. Let's keep looking for fuel. Uh, I got another book. Stack of papers, stack of papers. If I'm not mistaken, yep, here we go. Requires a hatchet to break down. I might have to drop some gear. You'll be fine. 38 minutes. Not bad, not bad. It should be. I'm kind of like fumbling around the darkness for it, but there's more fuel back this way. God damn it, it's dark in here. I would do anything for a drink right now. Right, get some water going. You down. Oh, maybe. Oh, shit. I need to drop something. All right, we'll, uh, we'll add this fuel just to kind of keep it going. Alright, we've got to go. Because outside, we've got the Aurora. Didn't have to wait too long for that, actually. I think it was only, like, what, two nights? Counting this one, it was only one night that wasn't the Aurora. But uh, we are going to have to kind of hurry over to the dam, because we're almost... Yeah, we're more than a third of the way through the night. And uh, we cannot afford to be waiting any longer for one to show up. Yeah, just stick to the trail, and uh, we should be getting to the dam soon enough. I don't know if it'll be like the end of the episode or not, but we'll see. I would like to start getting my, my teeth into episode 3. Alright, mate, gonna be lurking, have a good rest of the stream. Alright, miss, thanks for being here, bud. Appreciate ya.
this off. Hey. No. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. I got so much fucking ammo, you have no idea. Okay. Uh, I don't think I can kill these things. So I've wasted like three bullets. Which is... a lot more than I would like to have wasted. Now I'm now I'm anxious. Okay, we're uh we're not too much further. We'll just keep going. Just keep going. Everything is a okay. I I'm convinced that at least one of those shots had to hit. So they they've got to be some kind of like ghost wolf things. But I think they kind of hesitate and run off if I just point the gun at them, so I don't need to shoot at nobody. I could save my bullets for something a bit more dangerous, like uh, maybe another bear or a person or actual wolves. You know, general run-of-the-mill stuff. Should be right across that bridge. We'll uh, we'll see if we can get it all figured out. I can't remember exactly what I needed to do inside of the dam, but hopefully we can get it figured out. There's, there's probably going to be some kind of like enemy nearby, so like another ghost wolf or two, or maybe something worse. Who knows? God, it is a it is a party in there. Holy shit! Look at all them lights. I like how all the the lights are like different colors as well. Wow, that's fucking terrifying. All right. Gonna pretend I didn't see that. Hello, Santa. Don't mind me, I'm just going to the party. I doubt he has anything else to say to me. Alright, let's uh let's see what we got. God, I can actually see things. Alright, uh, what are we doing? Access the control room using Jeremiah's code. So, where would one access the control room? Right here. Ooh. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Alright, I'm gonna drop some stuff, because I would like to hold on to this, uh... to this flashlight this time. I, I never use hatchets. Like, ever. Hello. Well, we're gonna be here a minute. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. We got one. I went too far. I'm hearing footsteps in the background. It's starting to it's starting to put me on edge, but I think I'm just going crazy. Almost there. I swear, I'm hearing like footsteps in the background. And I'm, I'm getting nervous. I'm not ready for this to turn into a horror game. Hey, there we go. God, it took forever. Alright, what do we got? I think I can use Cash, this. papers, magnifying lens. Hell yeah. I am almost out of battery. So uh, let's get this done fast. There it is. I don't know what that did. Do we go somewhere else now? I'm over encumbered. What can we drop? What can we drop? Uh, these are pretty much expired. I, I think slightly expired food is less bad. Oh, and the flashlight's out of battery. Oh, I guess there's only one way to go from here. Oh fuck, dead guy. I would like a light. Won't last me too long, but it's better than nothing. Recycle can. Well, I guess I don't have to pick like a floor or anything, it can just go. Holy shit, what was that? I I didn't see anything. Cool, spooky exit. Oh, hot, hot, hot! Oh, that hurts. 
so much. Why did I get burned by it? I get like electrical burns. Ah, oh, shit. All right, hold on. Oh yeah, I'm, I walked over the same thing. It's gonna kill me. Oh, that hurts so much. All right, all right, I got you. I got you. Don't worry. The pain. There we go. All better. See. That treatment did not do anything. Okay, try not to walk over that again. I fucking died. <laughs> well, at least I can go back to whenever I wasn't dying from burns. So, I guess I gotta find a way to turn off some of this electricity. Let's see. Can't go that way. Is that a wolf? Why is there a dead wolf back here? So, whenever we got to this this floor, McKinsey said like what like what was that? And I I didn't see anything, so now I'm nervous. Cuz I'm starting to think that there's something in here. What's this? What's this? Where am I going? Like, there's fucking sparking electricity everywhere. I can't really do anything. I can go this way. Ah, here we go. Now we are cooking with gas. And by that, I mean we are going the right way. I am over encumbered. God damn it. I think I need to eat. I'm hearing footsteps. I swear to God, I'm hearing footsteps. Gas. Hey, I say that. All right, we'll we'll drop this. Uh, can we use that fuel that we just got? Oh wait, no, I didn't want to drop that shit. We'll light this. Uh, it's not as good as the flashlight, but uh, we'll just have to deal with it for now. Okay, so we were just in there. Whole lot of nothing. A lot of nothing. Can I refuel this? Like I have the lantern oil. I don't know. We'll we'll keep going without it. Our, our flashlight's charged at least a little bit now, so we can we can live with it. We can live without light for 
a little bit. A whole lot of nothing. Alright. Guess we're heading this way. Uh, there's... Oh. Hello. What, uh... What am I doing with this? Oh, this gets me back here. I see. I think we might need to take, like, a short rest. Because, uh... I think the exhaustion is what's starting to, like, make my carry weight go down. I'm getting, like, really bad vibes right now. Like, Mackenzie's seeing shit that I'm not seeing, and it's putting me off real bad. I better watch out. Can I, like, weave between those? Shit, that burns. Nope. Oh, that hurts so much. I'm working on it, Mackenzie. You just chill. There we go. Cool. So we need to find a way to turn off that electricity or find a way around it. Like so. Wow, I hated that. Alright. I think we just need to keep going. Ugh, another sprain risk. It's just gonna keep going down. Holy shit, that's hot. God damn. That hurts so much. Alright, well, I guess we're bandaging again. Oh, that hurts so much. Oh, it was timed. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Hi. Oh, a metal box. Oh. Where the fuck is this guy? <sighs> Nice jacket, by the way. A locked case. Wow, that is interesting. A locked metal case is a thing of the old world, stranger. A world of closed doors and things being off limits. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> now, there was no need for that. Yeah, see, I was part of that world. But that world's over. Oh, he's wearing a prison jumpsuit. This jump is my suit. world now. And in my world, I make the rules. 
In my world, see, there are no locks. Your world sounds crazy. What's in the case? I have no idea. What is in the case? I hope it's painkillers. What's in the box? Your ID says you're a pilot. You have a plane somewhere? My plane wouldn't do you any good. Yeah, should I show you what happened to the last person who lied to me? She didn't look so pretty after I was done. She? Oh, so now he's ready to talk. What you got? What do you got there, bud? Well, don't worry, pilot. Oh. I'll her soon. Damn. And that is the end of episode two. Uh, we'll sink our teeth into episode three a little bit. But I don't want to play too much. Alright, skip through that. So we can get to episode three. And we will skip through... There's an isolated community Ooh, in the northern part of a Great Bear. Someone there is very sick. Great and Bear? There's nothing there anymore. Not since... I know. But I have to get there. I seem to recall... A town somewhere up north. Far, what was it called? That's it. Perseverance Mills. It was like sparks everywhere and then fire. She fought like hell to try and get him out. We tried to stop her, but she ended up on the bus. Somehow, she was small enough to crawl through the crushed part. Did you see the lights in the night sky, the aurora? Well, when that flared up, the radio came to life. Just lit up, started spitting out noise, but it was all gibberish. Hello? Is this the radio station at Perseverance Mills? Is there a doctor with you? What's in the case? I have no idea. Don't worry, pilot. You'll be with her soon. Uh, oh god. Okay, I'm gonna need to mute the desktop audio for just a second because Twitch doesn't like whenever I play the music from this. And, uh, I'm gonna see if I can find a way to skip this. Actually, you know what, let me, let me play some nice tunes. Yeah, I cannot skip this at all. Come on. It just, it just keeps going. It's a shame that I can't play the music on Twitch because it's gonna get like copyrighted and they're gonna mute it on my VOD. But it's it's very, very good.
Oh, fuck. I've been really tired recently. I apologize. Okay. That's the end of the cutscene that has the music, so I should be able to turn on the desktop audio again and turn off my music. So am I playing as, like, a different person now? Howdy, stranger. So, she lives. Where am I? And she speaks. You're in my house. Found you out in the snow a few days ago. A, f a few days? Almost dead. You're half frozen and then feverish. Judging by those cuts, you've been dealing with more than just the bad weather. I... Uh... I ran into some trouble on the other side of that tunnel. <laughs> By the looks of it, I'd say the trouble ran into you. Where am I? I told you. My house. You're still weak. Rest up and we'll talk more later. No, no. I'm, uh... I I'll be, I'll be okay. Suit yourself. Then let's talk. House. House. You said we're in your house. But how did I get here? I was out hunting. Came across you in the snow. Buried. You've been out there for hours. Maybe even days. Nearly dead. Oh. Well, um. <laughs> Thank you. For finding me. Name's Molly. And don't thank me. <laughs> thank the crow. Crow? Yeah, a crow. Or maybe a raven. Damn bird wouldn't shut up. Led me straight to you. Almost like it was guiding me. Freaky. Power. So, power's been out for a while? Yep. Think it'll come back? Well, we're used to the power going on and off out here in Pleasant Valley, so we're usually prepared for it. Feels like we run this farm on generators for a better part of the year. Problem is, now the generators won't start, or the car's tractor. The TV's dead, radio won't work. Basically, the only thing that works is the old landline and rotary phone. How is that possible? I guess because it's pre-electronics. The old party line from when this farm was originally put in, maybe 60, 70 years ago. Oof. I'm not exactly sure how or why it still works, but it does. 
Well, that's great. Can you call for help? Find out what's going on out there? There's nobody to call. Nobody else lives around here? <laughs> nobody who'd help if you asked for it. Kitchen. Is this the kitchen? By the time I got you here, there was no way I was carrying you upstairs. So you set up a bed in here. Power's out. This is the warmest room in the house. This cook stove is probably keeping us alive. Carried. You carried me here? Dragged more like, but yeah. You were pretty far gone. Wasn't sure you'd make it, to be honest. Well, all I remember is the tunnel. And the wolves. Being chased and then wandering. No end. Yeah. In the woods. In the dark. You can wander for days until you get so hopelessly lost. There's just no way to get back to where you were. I was in a small town. In Milton. Other side of the mountains. Old town. Bad shape since the collapse. Haven't been there in ages. You must have wandered a ways for me to find you where I did. But you're not from there. No. The whole town. Milton. It's... It's gone. I mean... The people are gone. Most of them are. It was a fire and... <laughs> Whoa. It's okay. You're all right now. Don't get too worked up. You nearly died out there. I like this lady. She seems cool. Funny things have happened. Mackenzie. I was in a plane crash in the mountains. That's how I ended up in Milton. I I got separated from a from a friend. They were in the crash too. Yes. They make it out alive. There, there was a storm. Wolves. I, I got disoriented. We got separated. I, I couldn't, couldn't see him. Him. So you left him out there. And then I ran into trouble. Wolves and worse. I'm sure he made it out fine. Yeah. How are you so sure? Nothing could break that stubborn skull. Thought you were worried about him. Yes. And there's something I need from the plane. What is it? Something important. I need Very to Very descriptive. It. I need to get it back. You haven't seen a man pass through here. Nobody that sounds like your guy. But you've seen a man. Like I said. Nobody that sounds like your guy. Freezer's empty. You're gonna need energy to heal, which means we need meat. I'll be heading out early to hunt. Okay. You should stay here. Rest up some more. You don't look too good. Thank you. I will. The, and the, it feels it's not different. Safe out there, so just stay in the house. Like it. The way the characters are portrayed and everything, I mean, it feels different. But I guess it's because, like, because the the episode changed. They have like time to work on these things and make things better. Hello. Ah, you're awake. Thought you were resting. Managed to bag a stag not far from the farm. This will keep us fed for a bit. I heard a, a 
kettle whistling. I put it on for tea. So we can have tea and meat. I must be starting to feel better because that actually sounds good. It's amazing what hunger does to the mind. If you're feeling better, you can start answering some questions. Like, what the hell are you really doing out here? <sighs> That's a long story. Well, power's been out for... I've lost track of how long. We got the cold, we got deadly blizzards, we got hungry wolves, we got some tea and meat. We aren't going anywhere. So to be honest, a bit of storytelling be a nice distraction right about now. I am a doctor. I'm a doctor. Dr. Astrid Greenwood. Nice to meet you, Dr. Astrid. Like a head colds and babies doctor? More like lab coats and test tubes. A researcher. Oh, okay, so not the useful kind. I need to get to a town up north. Perseverance Mills. You know where that is? I don't get out much, but yeah, I've heard of it. Okay. Well, there's some sick people there, and they need my help. And the thing I lost in the plane <sighs> crash... The thing my friend might have. I need it if I'm going to help those people. The thing the stubborn guy you left in the plane crash might have? Right. So what you're saying is the thing you need is on the other side of that collapsed tunnel in the mountains, in the place where you ran into trouble. That's right. You know what? You coming here? To Great Bear? Yeah. Not your best plan. I mean, valid, yeah. So the people up north, in Perseverance Mills, why are they sick? I'm not entirely sure. That's why I need to get there. You must have some ideas, or why travel all this way? I have some ideas, yes. But you aren't going to tell me what they Oh, god damn. No. I'm fucking tired. I'm not. It's and like, the thing what, your friend in a plane crash has, the thing you need to help them, you aren't going to tell me what it is either, are you? Right. Well, you are a lady with a lot of secrets. I have your gun. So, when you came in, I heard you locking a padlock. Same thing when you went out. Am I locked in here? It's better for you to stay indoors. Why? Lots of wolves out there. And it's cold. Wolves can you open aren't doors? Enough to go out there yet. Trust me, it's for your own mm -hmm. safety. I appreciate everything you've done to help. But I'd like to leave. I have to find my friend and get on with my work. When you're stronger. So, I'm trapped in here. Like I said, it's for your own good. So, um, is your husband around? Husband? It seems oh, like she looks offended. Here. I assumed, uh, husband. Assumptions can be dangerous. You're a doctor, you should know that. I didn't mean to. Have... You should just mind your own business. But you just got back. I need space, need to think. I'm sorry. Stay out of my shit. Damn, she just turned on me on a, like on a dime. Looks like I'm not the only one with secrets. That's a shame. I, I felt like uh, I felt like we could have gotten along nicely. Anyways, time to root through a shit. I have a sprained ankle and that's it. I require a bandage. I like loot anything? 
What am I doing here? That's locked. That's locked. This is a nice house. A busted up gun. Looks like maybe the barrel exploded. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. Nah, they just built it like that. What do you mean, maybe? Oh. Oh. Looks like Molly. I'm rooting through your stuff. Rooting through your stuff. Oh lord, I'm rooting through your shit. He looks very unhappy in that picture. Thought I heard the door open. Just gonna fucking come bursting in. It's like, what part of don't root through my shit did I tell you? And they're just gonna shoot me in the chest. It's like a. Like, please, I might tell you more about Molly. What's this? Torn from something. What's that supposed to tell me? That actually startled me, goddammit. Hello? Uh, uh, hello? Thank God you answered. Molly? Yeah, it's me. Listen up, doctor. Okay. They have me surrounded. They're smart sons of bitches. Wh who has you surrounded? Are you in trouble? It's wolves. Not who, what? It's those damn wolves. They've cornered me in the barn. It sounds like they're trying to find a way in. But but wolves don't usually bother people. Don't bother people. Shit, lady, haven't even paying attention. Never mind that. Okay, okay. What can I do? I need you to bring me something from the house. Okay, but you locked me in here. Remember? Flower vase. Key to the basement's under it. Look for the gun locker. Grab the rifle rounds. Take the old revolver for protection. Might not stop a wolf, but it'll slow one down. Follow the blizzard line from the house to the barn. Get here quick and we'll figure it out. Hurry! Okay, okay, I'm on my way. Go straight to the gun locker. Stay out of everything else, got it? But, but I wanna... But I wanna root through things. I wanna look at things. Where's the flower vase? This thing... Oh shit, lady, you might die because I don't know where you where where the thing is. Okay, so that's the basement. Uh, ah, uh, uh, I'm looking for a vase and I don't know what vase I'm supposed to be looking for. Oh wait, it's probably this one. What has happened to my HUD? Like, I I'm completely lacking a HUD right now. Okay, it's back. I know they said to not go through anything. What the fuck? What? Ah! 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 <laughs> it's her dead husband. It is her dead husband. Holy shit. Put the fucking blanket back, you dumb bitch. Put it back. <sighs> okay, I yeah, I gotta I gotta treat that. Well, now she's gonna know that uh, I rooted through her stuff. 
Might as well Revolver. Bring For the wolves. Worse. This will come in handy. Sorry, you're taking me stuff. Actually, I totally lied. I'm not sorry. Get bit. You got a fucking dead guy down here. I feel like taking the liberties of keeping myself alive is well within reasonable. There are the lines to the barn. Done. Okay, where's this barn at? Is that it? Oh, yeah, that's a tractor. Which means... There's our barn. Shut up. Shut up. Alright, don't you dare. Oh, <laughs> I saw one run right by me. Oh damn, it's fucking dead. Oh, what the fuck? Sorry I bailed on you, but I couldn't take a chance and wait. One of those big bastards broke into the barn. And as luck would have it, I'd left my bow in here last summer completely forgotten. Anyways, took care of that son of a bitch. Molly, I, I was in your basement. Right. So? I, um, I found the body. Shit. Molly, who, uh, who was it? Why would you why would you confess to something like that? She said business. not to root through anything. I told you to stay out of my shit. Exactly. Look, if you're gonna break rules, you don't fucking say anything. A town meeting of some kind. Looks like the town's not too far from here. If Mackenzie did pass through, he might have ended up there. I feel like that's not too hard to comprehend. If somebody tells you not to do something and you do it. And my HUD's gone again. Hmm. That's odd. I, I don't understand why it's doing that. Hmm. I don't know. I'll figure it out. I think I'm going to wrap it up here, though. Uh, we've, we've gotten a little bite into, uh, into episode 3. So I'm looking forward to seeing what we got here. We got new characters, playing as a new person. It'll be a good time. Good times all around. So uh, yeah, y'all stay cool, stay hydrated, stay safe, and I will see y'all in two days time.